Hiya, Peter here with you again this week. And I'm going to talk a little bit today about the differences between NLP and meditation. These are probably the two practices which I use most in my life and the most I teach to others. And they're quite different and yet they're very, very complementary. Now, at first, it seems like nothing could be further than, you know, further apart than the two because NLP is often used for, you know, sales, uh, work, um, communication skills, negotiation skills, whereas meditation is very much, you know, introverted and by yourself. So they seem different and yet the two work very, very well together. Let me take NLP first. NLP in particular is good with working with our emotions. So it's great at getting rid of negative emotions, getting rid of limiting beliefs, things that cause you stress in the first place. Because the way NLP looks at it is that our mind is a whole set of patterns, patterns of thought, patterns of thought which create anxiety, stress, loneliness, you know, uh, whatever it is, whatever negative condition and positive condition, of course. And NLP is an expert at working with those patterns. It knows how those patterns originated and how to end them and get rid of them, even phobias. Whereas meditation is about mindfulness and knowing the mind. And it's through knowing our mind, we get to see our thoughts in real time. And as we see the thoughts, we actually see the patterns that they create and the results that they create. And with enough mindfulness, we can uh, predict what patterns are going to arise and take a different set of actions. So you see at the end of the day that both of them are about understanding our mind and understanding the patterns of our mind so we can change those patterns into more productive, more peaceful ways of working. Now, the main difference is that uh, NLP is very, very specific. Like we work on one particular emotion or one particular event in your life or one particular phobia that you've got, for example. And so to me, it's like a laser beam approach, just getting rid of just one issue, you know, getting rid of one relationship. It often will generalize into being more useful than that, but uh, that's the way NLP works. Whereas meditation, it's just improving mindfulness, which is like creating the foundation for understanding the mind. So as you have great mindfulness, then the use of NLP becomes even more powerful because in real time you can see what those uh, processes are doing. And the more you get rid of negative emotions, the better your meditation becomes. So one helps the other. Now, uh, I think that it's really great to use these in combination. And so what I su suggest that people do is to first of all start off using uh, general meditation because it's easy to learn. And then in your meditation, if you notice that there are some emotions or negative issues that are coming up uh, very often, then seek out some of the processes that we use in NLP. Anyway, good luck with it all and I hope you liked that uh, distinction between the two.